1. Yes, the condom challenge involves people snorting condoms. The condom challenge or condom snorting challenge title is pretty much on the nose. The latest viral meme making everyone regret the internet's creation sees a teen or anyone vying for fame put an unwrapped condom up their nostril and inhale it snorting until the condom travels down a person's throat and out their mouth. It's just as gross as it sounds and the challenge has gone viral, with thousands of people posting videos of the condom challenge to YouTube, per USA Today. 2. It's actually not new. This trend is actually more than a decade old, but social media has breathed some new life into this stupid stunt. A now-deleted video of the challenge was uploaded in June 2007, according to ABC News. Sana Strong, a YouTube star, uploaded a video of her successfully pulled off the stomach-churning feet in a 2013 video. It seems that after Tide Pods and Spoonful of Cinnamon, 3. Snorting condoms is a bad idea. Does this really need to be said? As Forbes points out, a condom is a large piece of latex rubber, covered in lubricant and designed not to break. It's not supposed to go through a person's nose. The condom could get stuck in a person's nose or throat, blocking the breathing passageway and causing someone to choke. On top of that, a condom could damage a person's sensitive inner lining of their nose, cause an allergic reaction or result in an infection. 4. People have gotten seriously hurt from ingesting condoms. Oh, but the condom challenge is just harmless fun, right? Nope. A 27-year-old woman who performed oral sex on a man wearing a condom suffered a horrific fate, according to a report published in 2004 in the Indian Journal of Chest Diseases and Allied Sciences, per Forbes. The condom went down her trachea and into her lungs. With one of her airways blocked, she contracted pneumonia and experienced a collapse of the right upper lobe of her lung. Another study, in the Journal of Medical Case Reports detailed a 26-year-old woman who accidentally swallowed a condom and developed appendicitis when a piece of the condom lodged inside her appendix. So, why risk it by shoving a rubber up your schnoz? 5. There was a different condom challenge three years ago. Back in 2015, the internet was full of fools filling condoms full of water before dropping them on other people's heads, according to the debrief. It was likely a parody of the Ice Bucket Challenge, which urged people to take part in order to raise awareness of ALS. This version, like the current condom challenge, was just to be stupid online.